Hi, this is Jason from Aguirre's Clocks. Uh, today we're going to take a look at troubleshooting your Allen design clock uh, and general uh, setup and hanging of it. So first things first, when you get it out of the box, because it's been transported, one thing you want to make sure of is to make sure all the hands clear each other, uh, front and back, including this little backside to the second hand, and that none of them are dragging over each other. They're made out of aluminum and in transport they can get pushed down in the same way uh, they're soft enough where if they are pushed down you can pull them back up and make sure they're clearing each other. Don't pull up really hard but just enough to get them all to clear each other. Uh, setting the time on it so that you can check that never turn the hands from the front side of this clock. You always want to use that round dial in the back to turn the hands. Uh, turning the hands from the front will cause problems with it. Uh, the little movements in these, all the gears inside of them are plastic. So if you rake the hands around too fast uh, or too many times, you can snap a tooth off. Now that can be dealt with, but someone will have to take the old movement out and replace it. So we wanna try not to do that. So you can check your hands, rotate that dial in the back to all the hands are directly on top of each other and then take a look at them, make sure that they're all clearing each other, and if they are, you're in good shape. Uh, the next thing is hanging it. You need to use a screw and a stud, a nail and a stud, or a very good hollow wall anchor. No picture frame hangers, and I would not suggest putting it just directly into the sheetrock, uh, just for stability reasons. This is a cast resin, so if it falls off the wall, it can actually shatter, and you don't want that to happen. So. In saying that, when you hang it on the wall, you can see kind of how far out my screw is sticking here. It's not very far, maybe a half inch. And the reason being is if you look at the back of the clock, there's two feet on the bottom and then you have the hanger at the top. You want that all to be flush against the wall. You don't want it kicked out this way or this way. If you're doing that, it's not gonna, they will still keep time but it will not swing the pendulum because the pendulum is swung with a magnet and it, that magnet pulses and there needs to be a space between the magnet and the piece of steel that is pulsing. Uh, if they're dragging each other or if they're too far away, they won't, they won't work. So hang it on the wall, make sure it's completely flush against the wall. If it's not, you may have to lift it up and take and screw the screw in further or nail the nail in a little bit further till it does actually sit flush. Uh, with the hangers, it's really preferable not to use a nail, but if that's what you have, you need to put it in at an angle so that the clock wants to suck back against the wall and not tilt forward. Uh, that will help you with this problem also. But those are the big things to check. Uh, it takes one AA battery, most of them do. Some of them take a AAA, but most of them will take a AA. And just make sure you put the battery in correctly. There's indicators on the inside of the movement that tell you which way, if not, you can take a look at this. We're going positive down, negative up. Uh, try to make sure that this little tab right here is out, that piece of cloth. It'll make it easier to pull the battery out the next time you need to change it. And in changing the battery, you got to go back there twice a year if you live in a state where there's time change. So you might as well just go ahead and replace the battery while you're at it. Uh, and if not, we really suggest doing it twice a year anyhow. Uh, they will last about a year, but what you don't want to do is let the battery get low in power in there because that's what causes them to leak. Uh, and we don't want that to happen either. If you have any questions, you can call 512-452-4558.